Hey everyone, Tyler Edwards here. Thanks for dropping by. Uh, in this video, I wanted to talk about a little piece of gear that I, I wish I would have purchased like years ago. And it's so simple, but it is so useful to have uh, in your kit. Um, for, this is not a sponsored video or anything. I, I bought this with my own money about a month ago or so. And uh, I posted it on my Instagram stories and I had a bunch of people reaching out asking me like what it was and, and, and what it's for and all that kind of stuff. Well, this is a, it's called the, the V-mount short form factor hot swap V-mount adapter, I believe. Uh, this is some people call it like a shark fin adapter, uh, but essentially what it does is it allows you to hot swap V-mount batteries uh, on your camera. So if you run like me, uh, you like to run maybe just one type of battery to power all of your accessories. So for me, it's V-mount, but you can use gold mount or whatever. But uh, for me, that's what I prefer to do. I prefer to you know, power my camera and all my accessories if I can off of one type of battery so that I really only have one type of battery I need to worry about charging on set, especially when I'm travel. Just keeps the amount of different chargers and stuff uh, at a minimum. So. Um, yeah, so that's what I do. I, I power everything off V-mount. So for example, on this red Komodo kit right here, you can see that I've got the, the core V-mount adapter plate right here. And it's nice, it's got a little one, one little D-tap right here. But what it uses is the Canon BP battery uh, slots that the red Komodo has built into it, which is cool that they have a built-in battery, but uh, I prefer to use uh, V-mount because I already have V-mount batteries. So I use this little plate to power everything. And right here, what it allows me to do is put a V-mount battery on the actual camera, which is really nice. It keeps the, keeps the camera nice and compact. So, uh, you know, if you're trying to be really lightweight, uh, it's really nice. Now, this is great if you are just doing a kind of shorter takes and you're not really concerned about powering the camera down uh, in between takes and everything. But if you're in a more fast paced environment, say a uh, running gun, uh, kind of doco style shooting where uh, you kind of need to have the camera on at all times, uh, to make sure you can hit record in a moment's notice or if you're doing a live event like um, like i was just on a live album record uh, shoot and we were uh, running a couple of komodos i was running a komodo and when we had when i had to switch batteries i had to you know let the director know that hey it's time for me to switch batteries and then there was like a whole coordination thing uh, while we're actually recording so that was not very ideal so a solution there is to be able to hot swap batteries and that's where this thing comes in. So essentially what it is, is it is basically like mimics like a V-mount battery right here and it mounts on to the existing V-mount battery plate. Now this isn't specific to this camera or this specific uh, core, you know, Komodo battery plate. This will work with any battery plate, which is awesome. So you have Ursa Mini Pro or uh, DSMC2 or the new uh, Red V Raptor or anything like that. You can run this right there and then you can put two batteries on here and you can hot swap your battery. So they say to like, you know, put one battery on and like maybe 10 minutes later while you're getting set up, put the next one on so that when this battery drains, this battery will, you know, have 10 minutes battery left on or whatever. So anyways, that kind of gives you a little bit of a buffer to swap it out. Now, the other really cool thing about this is even if you don't care about hot swapping batteries, the other really cool thing about this is you have four DTAP ports here on the top and some battery plates like this one here on the Komodo actually has one right here as well. So this right here gives me five DTAP outs and well, you know, with this configuration, not that really big of a deal, but if I were needed a power, uh, maybe a Teradek unit and a wireless follow focus and um, maybe I don't know, some, some, some other thing with DTAP. I have enough DTAP ports where I don't have to worry about using a DTAP splitter or anything like that. Now for me, um, I'm also using this little uh, two pin Lemo to power my monitor to kind of free up DTAP port. And that was kind of before I got this uh, little plate. But now that I have this, uh, this kind of can let me run this whole camera all day without having to turn it off. And which is really nice because I've been doing a lot of shooting where uh, it's, it's kind of fast paced stuff where I can't just like sit around with the camera off and then turn the camera on when I need to shoot because a lot of times I need to have the camera ready at uh, any moment's notice. So this is super nice, um, pretty short video here. I'm not trying to go into too much details. Uh, all the specs and stuff you can find on the website. I'll leave a link down below 
uh, in the description for uh, somewhere where you can buy it. Uh, but yeah, um, pretty awesome little thing. I really wish I had this um, a lot, you know, many years ago because this would have been super useful on many sets. Anyways, that's pretty much all I have to say about this little guy right here. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you found this useful. If you did, maybe hit that thumbs up button, consider subscribing and all that good stuff. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Peace.